Hi guys. Hey. Welcome to our YouTube channel. This is going to be our first actual family video. We are here at Walmart Grocery Pickup waiting for them to deliver our stuff. And so we will see how that goes. We're at a different Walmart this time, but it was closer to where we got our breakfast, which um, as you probably can see was some sweet tea from Chick-fil-A. And we also got donuts, which we do every Saturday. Um, say hi. Hi. Tucker is, well, he's actually not sleeping. He moved. <laughs> but anyway, so we're waiting for them to bring our groceries. And when we are done, we will do our first YouTube grocery haul for our family of nine. But right now we are eight because daddy is deployed. So you'll see what we got. <laughs> Are you going to help us with our video? Oh, oh, he hears Sissy in the freezer. What's she getting for you? Look what Sissy's got. What do you need? <gasps> oh, yes. See, I love my frozen strawberries. Oh, yes. Okay, so let's get started. We have some candy corn here. Um, I use this for potty training, which Reed is fully potty trained during the day, but he still, you know, comes and says, I went pee or I went poop in the potty. Can I have some candy? So he gets candy. We also use these during homeschool for incentives. Um, so yeah, these parm crisps, someone suggested that I try them. And so we're going to give those a try. We'll see. Um, we have our frozen fruits. Um, we give these to the baby. We also make smoothies with them. We also uh, defrost some of them for toppings on pancakes. Um, we have our frozen vegetables. We always have frozen vegetables in our freezer because I like to just throw them in the crock pot and make soup. And so these broccoli and cauliflower I usually use at lunchtime um, with my chicken. And the chopped kale, sometimes I'll put it in my smoothie. The kids will eat these red peppers. Well, I'll eat some too. Yeah, Kenzie loves those. And cucumbers. Here is pretty much all of our snack food for the week. This celery. I will probably be the only one eating the cauliflower. Maybe, I don't know. Um, avocados. I try to put these on salad, but they usually don't make it. Because the kids will eat them for a snack. They always eat at least half a bag of carrots every other day. So we have to get those frequently. Um, we have, these will probably be gone today, our cherry tomatoes, more apples, bananas that they eat a lot of, grapes, the toddlers, toddlers, our little kids, they're not toddlers anymore. Reed and Mallory will just take these to the table and eat on them. Strawberries, hopefully they won't be gone today. Um, hopefully I can get them to wait to not eat everything today. So, we also have unsweetened coconut flakes, coconut flour, cocoa. All of that is for baking cookies that we really enjoy. Or maybe we might make some cookie dough. I don't know. We'll see. Um, some almond butter for my apples. I got some toasted coconut cashews. The kids love mixed nuts. White vinegar for cleaning and for our washing machine. Um, a fresh spinach for a salad. Um, I might also throw some in my smoothies this week. We'll see. Um, kids eat sour cream quite a bit, so I probably chose the wrong size, but when you're ordering on Walmart, you have to pay more to do. Greek plain yogurt is what I'll use in my smoothie or just eat it for breakfast. We have shredded cheese, which we use three meals a day, breakfast, lunch, dinner. We always find a way to use cheese. So we keep quite a bit of that. Over here we have coconut milk, which is what I put in my smoothies and in my coffee. Kids milk, we have some milk in the freezer, but I was ordering, so I just decided to get some more. Is that good? Say, oh yes, that is so good, Mom, thank you. 
Yeah. I ordered apple cider, but apparently they didn't have any. So they substituted more apple juice, which we already have, but they'll definitely drink this. I got a new blender because mine is breaking on the bottom. Well, you can't see it. It's on the inside there. Half of it's broken. And so sometimes it leaks. And I, we've had this blender probably since we got married. So that's been 13 years. That's not good. Um, anyway, so I got a new one that actually has a spout to pour so I don't make so much of a mess. So this will be a wonderful thing. And we've got more paper towels. And here are pull-ups for Reed. He wears these to bed because I'm still just nervous about him <laughs> being in bed. So he'll keep wearing these for a little while until I'm sure that he is potty trained at night. So that's it. That's what we've got. Let's turn this around. We will come back and do a refrigerator and gr and freezer video to show you what we have and how I kind of go about shopping because this is not our large grocery haul. Our large grocery haul is once a month or once or twice a, twice a month. This is just our grocery haul to restock the things that we didn't get last week which was actually Monday because we came home from South Carolina and so we picked up groceries on Monday afternoon so I really didn't do a big grocery haul Monday this is not really a big grocery haul either so we'll bring another video next week to show our actual grocery haul with meat and stuff like that so um, that's it don't forget like and subscribe pull-ups yeah your pull-ups when do you wear those when you go night night? Mm. Yeah, so that's pretty much all we've got. Woohoo! The rest of our donuts from breakfast. We have a whole nother dozen. dozen. So they will use it tomorrow. So yay! For breakfast! Yes. Say bye!